we've got some friends here in studio with us right here. Yeah, we've got Gulliver. We've got the Gulls. The San Diego Gulls, of course, are hosting Fan Appreciation Night at their very last home game, which is going to be this Saturday. There's going to be a tailgate, giveaways, auctions, raffles, and more. So we've got Matt Savant here with the Gulls to go over everything. And Matt, I know the season coming to the end, it's a little bit bittersweet, but we yep. want to make sure that we celebrate the fans. And how are we going to do that? Well, this is our final weekend of games. If you haven't been out to a Gulls game this year, this is your last chance. We play tomorrow night and Saturday, and Saturday is our fan appreciation night, and we've got all kinds of fun stuff planned. And we've got the Gulls girls here, and we've got Gulliver, so we're, we're going out <laughs> with a bang this year. And uh, our fan appreciation night, well, kind of start on Friday. We're going to okay. do a special thing where we're going to actually auction off these third jerseys. These third jerseys oh, are really wow. unique. They're kind of beautiful, Here. different than what we traditionally wear. The blue is mirrored after the uh, San Diego Ocean, and uh, the Gulls logo is kind of a look uh, into the past. We've uh, worn this in the 1960s and 1970s. Oh, in style. wow. So uh, we're going to do an auction for our foundation tomorrow night after the game, and we're going to have the players take the jerseys off after they wear okay. them, sign them, and then all the proceeds from Friday night will go directly into the foundation. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. And it, again, it's celebrating the fans, but also having the fans being able to contribute back to the goals and, and the good work that you guys do yeah. behind the scenes as well, too. It's really important that we give our fans the opportunity to help give back, which we mm -hmm. do through our foundation to San Diego. We're really involved in a lot of local children's hospital uh, and uh, the local schools. So uh, as we transition into Saturday, which is our actual fan appreciation night, we've got a really fun night planned where we're going to start at 5 p.m. out in the parking lot. We're going to have a tailgate and we're going to invite all of our fans to come out at 5 o'clock. We're going to have a band. Monkey Jam is going to be playing in okay. the parking lot. They're a great local band. We're going to have uh, discounted Gulls Blue Line Blonde Ales, which is a great beer that we brewed with our partner, Second Chance Brewing. We have food trucks. And then as you make your way inside at 7 o'clock, the first 7,000 fans are going to get this amazing Lukash Dostal bobblehead. Uh, I want to tell you guys a quick little story about this bobblehead. Uh, it's kind of rare that a goaltender can actually score a goal. Yeah. <laughs> but last year, we had a game where Lukash Dostal, Dostal scored a goal in the final minute of a game in which he had 50 saves and scored a goal and we won. And so we're going to commemorate that event with this bobblehead. It's really a cool thing. This is the first time in our franchise history for the Anaheim Ducks or the San Diego goals that a goalie, goalie. has scored a goal. Oh my God, it was an amazing moment right there. And you guys know uh, back at home, uh, I'm a big connoisseur of the bobbleheads because I feel like one myself. So <laughs> this is a really cool uh, giveaway. And, and just again, real quick, the first, how many fans that get first in? First 7,000 fans wow, that come okay. in. So get in early, make yeah. sure you get this cool bobblehead. And then once we get in, we have all kinds of events for the fans. We're going to be giving away a lucky rose. are all going to get prizes from our partners. And then the big thing is at the end of the night, we're going to have what's called our jersey off the back. So we're going to invite 20 lucky random fans that okay. we're going to choose that as soon as your ticket is scanned, you're in the lottery to win these. 20 fans will come down, actually sit, stand next to a player. He'll take his jersey off, sign it right there and actually pose for a photo with you. Kind of an unforgettable memory for people. That's for so 20 cool. Fans, yeah. And as you hear about like what they say about the lottery is you can't win if you don't play. <laughs> right. You can't win if you don't go to the game. Gotta right? come on Saturday. And, yeah. and they're playing Calgary, which again, even on the ice, that's gonna be an exciting matchup. Uh, Calgary number one in the Pacific, right? Calgary's gonna be a terrific matchup. Yeah. They are a great team and they have a really good goaltender, so it's gonna be a really good duel for our fan yeah. for our, our, our players and our fans to enjoy. And that's awesome, Matt. And then just kind of just kind of wrapping everything up here as the season is coming to an end. What's it been like? Again, being still here in San Diego, obviously yeah. the community, so much love for the goals. Yeah. What's it like? Well, we're, we're in our first full year without any COVID restrictions. Yeah. So I'm going back to the beginning of the season when we were talking about how exciting it is just to get fans in the building without having to have proof of vaccination or masking rules. So the ability to actually interact with our fans and have mm -hmm. our players be back into the community has been really a, a breath of fresh air that I think the San Diego community needed. I know that I did just to get back to some normalcy. So it's been a really good year for uh, a return to normalcy. Uh, f moving forward into next season, we have a ton of really good players coming up. We're really excited about the, uh, the future draft picks. So yeah. next year will be an exciting year. Awesome. Matt, yeah. thank you so much. Thank Congratulations you. on a great year. Thank you guys so much for visiting us. Gulliver, you got a good bobblehead impersonation real quick before we go to break? <laughs> there we go. There we go. All right, man. All right. Thank you, guys. We'll catch you back after the break.